Please don't sink my bombard. I know I'm taking a big chance here, but I'm cool. Alright, let's embark. Go there. Go. We'll find you, Saladin. He might have like two or one or two more cities up there. Uh, right. Keep going. Whoa! Pantanal. Honestly, that's pretty good too, but it's nothing compared to the, um... Torres del Paine, I think it was? Or Pine? Yeah, this one's like really good. If you look at the City of Brown Sharks, it's not really that impressive, but if you look at the tiles surrounding this wonder, that's actually real nice. Have you ever read the Dune books? I have not. Are they good? I'm assuming they are, otherwise you wouldn't be asking. I don't think anyone's ever asked if you read that book, and then you say yes, and they're like, yeah, it's, it's garbage, right? I don't think that really happens. So, one thing that we could do would be to liberate Hong Kong. Alright, let's just get back to Cairo. At least we know sort of where uh, Brazil is now. Gandhi is just spreading his garbage religion again. Actually, thinking about it logically, Saladin only has two cities. Because he had one available for uh, giving away, and the other one must be his capital, so... Yeah. Two cities left to take. Uh, let's get an art museum here, too. Because we are getting all the great people that exist. Uh, Medina. Honestly, I love, like, a boat. Alright, let's see what we're doing. Okay, so that's the city that, like, was available for giving away. And as you can tell, it's quite garbage. And I honestly don't think that it is even capable of attacking me. I mean, it doesn't have walls, so... Same with this. Back, Dad. We'll take this, no problem. This is gonna be incredibly easy. Alright, we'll just wrap this up. We'll just burn these two to the ground. Like, I don't want them. And, you know, the more cities you have, the more money it's going to cost you if they are not profitable. So we're just going to burn that to the ground. All right, let's heal this guy up. Get some wheat for Lagash. Because I like Lagash. It's a pretty all right city. I mean, yeah, I, I destroy everything, but after I destroy it, I build it back up a little bit, and that makes me a good person. If you only destroy, they're bad, but if you if you just build up a little bit after the, after the fact, then you're good. Fire purifies all. That's a good way of putting it. Thanks, man. There are cliffs all around back there. That's true. I mean, it looks pretty cool, but it's in, like, tundra, snowy area. Oh, wait, you mean that I can't get up there? Hey, that's a pretty good point. What is this? What is this sorcery? I've never seen something like this. Let's go over there, boys. Let's go take Damietta first. I don't even know what that is. I mean, I'm assuming it actually exists. What's up, be bearded zucchini? You kind of sound like G.W. Bush right now. In regards to Baghdad, you don't even have a Dutch accent. Wait, do you mean I sound like the... I've never listened to W that well. Am I pronouncing it weird? Baghdad. Uh, I'll take a scientist. Sure, if it's free, I'm down. So we got some boosts for chemistry and one other random. Actually, we already have chemistry, I think. Or yeah, chemistry. Yeah, we already have a boost, so that's a complete waste. Oh well. Sanitation. Okay. Oh, just raising back that. There we go. Okay. I thought I was I was I was getting really self-conscious thinking that I was saying things weird or incorrectly. Uh let's go up there. <laughs> George W. Bush never raised back dad. No, that's true. Uh, right, so Kabul's slightly happy with me, don't know why, don't really care either. Alright, we fixed this up pretty nicely. Like, this city is, is, is decent now, but we can make it better. How many more builds do you have? Four! Now that's impressive. 
You sound like you are from New York. Why is that? Why specifically New York? Don't New Yorkers talk really weird? Granted, New York was a Dutch colony. Yeah, we still call it New Amsterdam over here. We're still really salty about it. Dude, that's a garbage deal you're offering me. You're shortchanging me. Get out of here. Look, I'd like to just wrap this up. That'd be cool. This whole war thing, I don't like it. Actually, I do. It's pretty fun. You guys should try it. Uh, we need a lot of housing around here. Let's get some of that desert beachfront property. That's gonna sell like hotcakes. That is kind of your accent. Really? I, I don't know. I don't know what New York people sound like. I don't- I can't really make a distinction between U.S. accents that much besides, um, the South and stuff. And I've seen Fargo, but I've always figured that was just sort of like a caricature. Hey, what's going on, Alja? He didn't get a notification again. Oh, that's stupid. Uh, Quila, let's get a shipyard. That'll contribute at least a bit. Uh, we need housing here too. Yeah, that's that. That would work out. Who doesn't want to live in between a holy site and a field of wheat? No, I mean, I know there's a difference. I just don't really know it that well. You are Dutch. Yes, I am. Fargo is straight legit on the accents. Really? It just always... I don't know. It's just, they have pretty interesting accents, to the least. Uh, we're going to have to do this, like, at some point anyway. All right. Put her down, men. Right in between the holy site and a nice quarry. I'd love to live there. How are we going to get here? Can we... What is this? This is new. Naval combat units that enter adjacent plots are granted their next promotion? That's nuts. Lysfjord. What is that? Norway or something? I have no idea. I'm just assuming here. Right, here we go. Sorry, city. We're going to have to burn you up. Fargo is kind of a caricature. Minnesota has a really neutral accent to the point where weathermen are trained to speak there. No, so much Minneapolis, but the ruler and suburban is so legit. Oh, all right. I feel like usually people that are, that live in like rural areas have a, uh, an interesting way of speaking. I'll take that. That's probably pretty good. Um, right, we could assault back that from the ocean. I like that. It's in Norway. Wait, did I say Norway? Was that correct? Florida was settled by a lot of Yankees after the Civil War, which is why you wouldn't won't get a lot of Southern accent. Yeah, that's true. That's interesting. Isn't Florida like a lot of... Um, or maybe it's just Miami, I think, where a lot of Hispanics live there or something? Is that because of something similar? Maybe that's just Miami. Maybe that's not Florida. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Sure. Lagash deserves the finest of farms. Right, so we, we got some wine. Now my people can get drunk. Carpet baggers? What does that mean? Bob Ross is a southern accent. I've actually never watched any Bob Ross stuff. Hmm. Yeah, I guess we could do that. That'd be alright. Okay. We'll work that eventually. Uh, it's close to Cuba. That makes sense. The further south in Florida, the more liberal it becomes. So you just really like sticking to the north? Oh, thank you, Mr. Bearded Zucchini. Yeah, I still like your name, by the way. How'd you even come up with that? Bearded Zucchini. <laughs> we got progress towards a nuclear program in 1350 AD. That is some 
Interesting stuff. Uh, Crystal Redentor is pretty, pretty dank. But I, I would like Bratwai. Thing is, we're not even going to get to actually make any more wonders. Or we don't really have to, because we'll win anyway. Oh, we got Chris Pratt. Yeah, finally. Someone, someone notices it. Uh, right, this is Nuri. Sure, I like a stock exchange there. Let's get a factory here. Yeah, I love him too, man. That guy's so good. Uh, fix the monument. So we got three envoys now, which is pretty sweet. So I want really want Mohenjo because that's going to give me a lot of housing. And, ooh, this is pretty good too. Let's get Kabul as an ally too. How many envoys have I sent? Yeah, pretty good amount. Pretty good amount. Uh, from here, Napata. Can we reach Pok Pokrovka? We can't reach it from here. Interesting. All right, we'll try with Iridu. How is that reachable yet? Oh, they already have one. That must be why. That's a bit weird. Hey, what's going on around the Twitch? What kind of victory are we trying for? We're going hard for that domination. And uh, basically we already won. I mean, let's be honest, but... We just gotta actually do the stuff that we gotta do. To do it. I watch a Frisian YouTuber. You sound nothing like him. I mean, we don't really sound like uh, Frisians. I mean, even in the Netherlands, small as we, as we may be, there's a lot of different accents here. And uh, people from Frisia even have, like, their own language. Which is, like, uh, I don't understand it. If I, I Okay, I can decipher it a little bit. But I think it's, like, really similar to Old English or something. Alright, take that city. We are burning this bad boy to the ground, by the way. Because this isn't going to go anywhere. We got one of their units, apparently. Probably, yeah, another builder. Razor, boys. That city's got nothing going for it. All right, here we go. Amphibian assault. All right, get those guys over there. We might not even actually need our land units with the uh, the navy coming in. We're too strong. Isn't even part of the Netherlands. What do you mean? I mean, you know, I haven't they had like um, talks about being independent in the past. I think they've, they've they've done that or it's been brought up or something. I'm going to chop down this forest. Well, I think I'll chop this one down too. I don't like forests. There's too many trees. I don't trust it. Alright, that's another pretty good tile. What's going on, Donnie? Welcome to the stream, man. I'll just be listening for a bit. I've got to do some stuff. All right, no worries. I appreciate you coming out. Ah, I have the worst mug to drink tea from. I hate this thing. It was my friend's birthday like two weeks ago. Actually, no, it's like a week ago. Oh, we got a promotion for our guy. And um, we just got him some, some like meme presents. And um, we got him like an emoji mug and I got one for myself too. And it's like horrible. It's like rounded at the top and it's impossible to drink tea from this in a correct way. It's suffering. All right, let's, uh, okay. So we burned that city to the ground. On to the next one, on to the next one. Murderers can never sleep. Goodbye, Baghdad. Let's cover that city in explosions too. Nope, didn't, okay. Get a straw. Why would I drink tea through a straw? That's I've, I don't think I've ever seen anybody do that. It is an interesting proposal, though. <laughs> Maybe I'll try. Actually, I don't have any straws. And I, I would feel really silly buying straws purely to drink tea from an emoji mug. That's just too meme -y. What's your favorite meme? Uh, I don't... I don't have one. I don't have a favorite meme. Uh, let's see. I mean, I don't really go looking for memes or anything. That sounds dangerous with hot tea. It might melt the straw or something. 
Ambrosius, thank you for the follow, man. I appreciate it. I'm telling you to drink tea through a straw, not pond water. <laughs> I mean, if I had to choose what to drink through a straw, I'd probably go for tea, yeah. It's, uh, it's still pretty close, though. Uh, right, we're chopping that down. We're chopping you down, you little forest. Get out of here, man. Ooh, shipyard would give two production, which is not very good. Housing capacity is absolutely fine, but they need amenities bad. Entertainment complex will fix that. We just toss that up over there. Actually, that was probably a bad choice because we got like all these farms linked up, but oh well. Me IRL or our crappy design? I don't like me IRL anymore. It's too many of the same jokes. It's too many like, oh, they'll upload anything. Like it started being like a little retarded and they've become so retarded that it actually is retarded. It's not no longer people memeing in a retarded way. It's just actual retarded right now. So I like crappy design more. That's pretty funny. Jumping back in. I was I once thought straws were childish, but I started a year ago and I haven't looked back. You can lay down and drink with a straw. That's true. I always wonder about people that complain about how there's nothing to do where they live. Oh wait, I missed something. Go all four and shatter in a mug. But I don't want to. I paid for this, man. Dank meme is pretty alright. Me IRL, it's a subreddit with like meme stuff. Oh wait, we got a promotion for my guy. Guys, make sure that he can escape when he gets caught or something. We need to get that coal that I was talking about so we can upgrade our boats though. There's some there. Can I buy it? Nope, too far away. Okay, that's a bummer. Uh, let's get another quarry then. Can't believe I haven't done that. If I have a webcam for next stream, I'll show you guys the stupid mug. That's a bad deal. Sorry, Saladin, but you're going to have to die. I feel like I could handle living where there aren't a lot of attractions and crap. I mean, everybody's different. Some people are, like, not very good at doing their own thing and stuff. All right, here we go. Get me that quarry. Apparently, I ignored it last time, which was a bad idea. Uh, okay. So we're going to get that coal. That's what we need is some coal. And harbor. Would that be good? That'd be all right. From 1 out of 10, what do you think about Harambe? I actually really like the Harambe stuff. Still do. Because that was actually funny. Is what I is what I thought. But it's uh, that, that kind of died out. Which is a bummer. I would have liked seeing more of that. Frigate, Privateer, Coastal Raid. I'll try Privateer, why not? Dicks out for Rambe. I always, when I'm at a party and you're able to, like, mess with the playlist, I always put on Dicks out for Rambe by Rocky Gold. Might have to time you out if you keep being such a normie. Jesus Christ, dude. Jesus. What are you, a meme? What are you, a living meme? Here we go. Yeah, that city is pretty much a goner. Let's just, like... I think I might want to use the Caravel, but the Musket Man is really close to an upgrade. I think I'll just let the, um, the Musket Man handle it. Let's go. Let's see if we can figure out where Ghani's capital is. Right, so we know that he's, like, here. we got to figure out his base of operations and then burn it. All right, everybody. We're done here. Time to move on. Abort mission. Everybody go home. Arabia is on the verge of death anyway. We're good. Wait, did I just... Yeah, I probably shouldn't have moved both Garavels away. I mean, it's, it's still alright, but whatever. Travis Pokrovka. 
Look, he's got zero great work, so I can steal. This kind of sucks. I would have liked to steal something. Let's just do some of those stupid basic missions that we can do. I think Gandhi's capital might be down here somewhere. Brazil's apparently, like, expanded a lot. Brazil's gonna be a real pain in the ass to deal with later. I can already tell. Alright. Ignore, ignore. Can't afford... Actually, we can get a promotion here. Take that. Get your shot in, Bombard. Alright, so we lost Kabul. I like to keep them, though. I want to keep Anton to Revo too, but Pedro's being a jerk about it. And there goes Baghdad. 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 How's the AI with the new update? It's still weird. I gotta be honest. They make some really odd choices all the time. Uh, throughout this whole game, they've been doing that kind of stuff where I was threatening their capital, and they started instead of and they had no more units, and instead of making units, they started making the hanging gardens and stuff. This was towards the beginning. And it happened in uh, Warsaw, I believe. Yeah, over here. They started making the Hanging Gardens. And then uh, Congo did the same. They started making it there when I was about to uh, take them out. So they still make some really odd decisions. I'm not sure how much better it is. All right, Mohanjo is, is happy. Saladin is down. Time to move on, I say. We're done here. Mission complete. Ura. Let's go. We gotta find out where Gandhi lives and beat beat him up. But I suspect he might be down here. Oh my, he's certainly he's got a lot of stuff down there. It only took you 30 minutes to beat Saladin. No, this has been like an hour or something. Is that on the top level AI setting? No, we're playing on six out of eight, Emperor. So it's like, it's like hard difficulty, but not like impossible. Like we can play on Deity. But the thing is, I don't think they actually make better choices when you play on a higher difficulty. It's mostly to do with, they just kind of cheat when you're playing on a higher difficulty. Uh, which is kind of a bummer. All right, get, get some, get some farm. Right, I got some questionable tiles around here still. This is really nice though. That's a lot of food. Uh, quarry. Worry me up. I miss Arabia. I mean, I guess you could rewind the stream. Is that a thing you can do? You could rewind it a couple of minutes and you could still see him. As if he had never been dead. Right, so he wants to trade. That's a bad deal. Wait, what? One horse for Faust. And two gold. See, that's what I'm talking about. The AI... Not exactly a logical guy. He just gave me a book for for a horse. Like, he actually just did that, and I don't know why. That was probably one of the worst trade deals I've ever seen. How does that even happen? I do not know. Let's put that in Pokrovka. How do you get theming, anyway? It said something about theming. Oh, it's gone now. Okay. Never mind. Goes for good. Well, that's a nice uh, free gray work that I very much enjoy. Right. Steel's boosted. Oh, dude. Eight production? What? Eight production from a single tile. How does that work? Okay. I'm not even going to question it. How much production do they get, Nubia? Is it like one or two from a, a mine? Mines over strategic resources provide plus one production. So normally it'd be seven, which is still insane. But we get eight production out of that. That's just stupid, man. That's way too much. Uh, Cairo. I'd like a university, sure. All right, let's get some more farms going. All right, so we've possibly figured out where Gandhi lives. I'd say that we have. 
over there. Uh, we gotta find a point of entry though. It could be Mumbai. It could be whatever is out there. Not entirely sure yet, but let's regroup around Medina. And we'll, uh, we'll go for it. We might have to actually get a slightly bigger army though. Right, so you could actually go down cliffs, I guess. Get out of here, cross or swordsman, barbarian man. We don't like your kind around here. All right, let's go. The navy is ready to rumble. So with Gandhi, he's got you know so many cities that we might just go for his capital only, or just you know make a path to his capital, take that. Like it looks like he's got everything down here. He's apparently got another city up there. At least two. So, uh, we got another general. District in this tile gains plus one air unit slots. Okay. You should do an eastern invasion on Gandhi. Yeah, that's probably the way we're gonna do this. Let's do this. So, Krakow does not have an encampment. Actually, they do. Alright, so they'll be alright if they make a unit. Uh, knights are pretty good. Actually, no. Field cannons are way better. Let's get a cavalry, though. I like cavalry. Any city, yeah, any city that can make cavalry in a uh, pretty decent amount of time is going to do so. Because I want the biggest army that the world has ever seen. Let's see. See, I can just buy stuff. Like, I got so much faith, so much gold saved up that I can buy an entire army. We can buy infantry here. How is that a thing? We already have replaceable parts. We actually have, like, World War II infantry despite the year being 1400. This is interesting. Alright, so... I'd say work that instead. Alright, see you later, Zim. Thanks for stopping by, man. Uh, right, more farms. Always nice. Man, just look at the food. I like Bakrovka. I like it. Alright, let's get this guy over to our to our army. Probably never use that one anyway. Because I honestly tend to not make too many air units. I don't know why. I know they're good. They're just kind of boring to me. Probably because they can't move by themselves. They're just kind of stuck in the air. And that's why they're bad. Alright, here we go. Let's get that bombard to safety as well. Alright, the frigate. The musket man. Also, we gotta upgrade our caravels, I just realized, because we have that coal now. So we gotta get them to friendly territory for that, for their mandatory upgrades. Right, just join your buddy. Ah, look at that. This would be an excellent spot to attack him from. Uh, we have to deal with the encampment that he has. But that's all. If we just take that out from the beginning, or ignore it, uh, we should be okay. I know that he's got a big army, but... Yeah, it's pretty big. Religious victory. I can't believe that five people are already taken out. There used to be ten civilizations in this game. Yet only five remain. Okay, so we're like about to win the... Not about to win, but about to take the lead in the cultural victory too. Uh, I like that. Harbor. Should we grab a harbor though? Is that really going to be that good? Rather than say... Another theater square? No bonuses there. Entertainment complex would be an option, but all these tiles are like somewhat all right. Right, got one build. Oh, Stingzy, thank you for the for the follow, man. Appreciate it. Um, but the Forbidden City. Oh, that sucks. Okay, Hermitage. Nope, not gonna work. I got like nothing that's actually going to work. Let's just get a neighborhood before we do anything else. Then. Put it probably over there, right? Yeah, that's the best it's going to get. Chop down some of these trees. Speed that up. Uh, amphitheater in Auric. Amphitheater in Gator Town. 
Right. Where'd that barbarian go? Oh, he went running for the hills. As soon as he saw my infantry, he was like, nah, I didn't deal with that shit. I'm out of here. Wait, we got pikemen. See, I knew that some element of my army was missing, but this is it. It's the pikemen. I never upgraded these guys because they don't have any available upgrades yet. So I just kind of left them be because they are pretty sucky now.